Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to quickly talk about the questions that I've been asking um, by some people um, regarding if their money is safe in Royal Q. So, yes, I am going to assure you that your money is safe in your own exchange. Okay, so Royal Q is just a company, it's just an app that is trading for you they don't hold your capital so your funding your trade funding they don't have access to it it's only you that have got access to your trading funds and your trading funds are in your binance account or hobby account whichever one you are using so this is binance exchange and that is my balance there so that is my money. Royal Q doesn't hold any of my money. They are only trading for me. They don't hold any of my money. So if you, if I want to go by your question, saying that um, is, is your money safe? Yes, I will say your money is safe in your, in your own account. Okay? So this is the topic. This is the, the, the title of this video. Is your money safe? The answer is yes, your money is safe. Okay, because your money is in your Binance account. So it is safe. Let me show you something. So let's assume that you put in 3,000, 4,000. This is just one of my accounts that I use for, for, for training. That's why it's got this amount of money in it. I've got a second account in Royal Q that's got bigger money in it that is trading for me as well. But I, I like to keep this for, tra for trading purposes. So for example, this is 1,000 US dollars here. And I decided that I don't want to do anything with Royal Q again. I want to stop today or I need my money urgently. Okay. The best thing you can do if that happens is if you come back to your Binance account because you have the full authority over your money. They don't keep your money. That is the, the, the best thing about Royal Q. It's your money is safe. You are not giving it to some kind of vendor or giving it to some kind of people that is going to disappear tomorrow and then you disappear with your money. No, that doesn't happen in Royal Cube. So let me prove that to you. So this is my um, Binance account. If I go to my Fiat and Sports, for example, and these are all the coins or the coin pairs that are being traded so if i open up my royal q app which is this you will notice that some of these if not all of them are reflected in my binance account so for example if i want to close any of this trade and i want to take my money say i don't i don't want any of this trade again you see all this coin here I don't want them anymore. I just want to take my money. So you choose how do you want to take your money? Do you want to take your money uh, via USDT or you want to take your money via BTC, which is Bitcoin? So if you want to do that, come into, so this is your Royal key. Remember, everything that is showing here is actually on this um, Binance. So if you come back, don't worry about Royal key just now. If you don't want to touch it, say, suppose, this app disappears today. You don't have, you, you, you no longer have any access to it. Come back to your Binance account. When you go into your Binance account, you see this bit that it says convert. Click on convert. And then where do you want your money to go? You want to convert to BTC. So you click max. And then you click preview conversion. Click preview conversion. It's going to tell you minimum is this because I don't have enough USDT. So if I swap that about, say I want to convert my BTC to USDT. So if I click there and then click preview conversion. So it's going to give me the value. So it's going to ask me, do I want to take 54 USDT? So if I click there, it's going to convert it to USDT. And then once it's in USDT, I can now sell off my USDT and take my money. So you have full control of your money in your exchange. Royal Q doesn't have 
full control of your money. They don't have access to your money. So only you can stop and sell off all your trades and take your money. So an example is this again. So if you go to your spots, go to spot order, when you go to spot order and then go to order history, if you go to order history, you will see all your coin as well. So you see the dates. So you will see that a the app has done one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So it has done thirteen trades already today. So it's awesome. The app is awesome. So if you are not in Royal Q, you are missing a lot. You need to come into Royal Q. I'm going to leave my link below this video description for you to join. And I welcome you to my team. We have a um, small community that we share ideas together and share strategies. So if you want to join Royal Q with me, please click on the link below this video description. Sign up and contact me on Facebook. And then we talk strategies. We talk how we are going to benefit more from Royal Q and make some good money um, um, from Royal Q. So your money is safe. Let me uh, reassure you that your money is safe in your Binance account, in your Binance exchange. Nobody is touching your money. Remember that. Always remember that nobody touches your money. That is one good thing I like about the app because I have full control of my money. Nobody has got control of my money. I'm not giving my money to some kind of company that is going to run away tomorrow and disappear and my money is gone. No, it doesn't happen in Royal Q because you have full access to your to your money in Royal Q. So thank you. If you find value in this video, please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to hit the bell button so that when I upload a new video, you will get notified. I will see you in my next video. Thank you for watching.